What's going on everybody? It's your man Hollywood Sports back with another video, man. Running with my commanders, trying to run this Madden 25. We're going on the road playing against these Tampa Bay Buccaneers. There's my man Jaden Daniels warming up. We are ready, guys. We are ready. Are y'all ready? If you are new to my channel, thank you for clicking on my video and welcome to Hollywood Sports. Let's get it. I like so those fun. camera angles right there. These guys, they know it's each new other. to the game. They study each other. They work together in the off seasons. A lot of times they're friends. Come game day, there is no question. At the end of this one, yes, they want their teams to win. But when they put their two box scores up next to each other, there's going to be All some right, here we go. rights come this off season. This one taken at the seven. Across the twenty, they'll mark him down before the twenty-five yard line. That's where the offense <laughs> can take over. The Commanders come out with the man they hope leads them into their new era. Jaden Daniels, the number two overall pick in this past draft from LSU. Greg, this is the man who won the Heisman Trophy with the Tigers in Baton Rouge. All right, guys, what I'm going to do, I got to fix my depth chart. I keep forgetting to fix that because when I start my franchise, um, we're going to put Jahan Dotson in a slot. Um, he won't be the second wide receiver. We're going to put De'Ami Brown there. Um, because De'Ami Brown, um, his speed is only one. Uh, he's he's slower than Jahan Dawson in speed, but I want Jahan Dawson working in the slot. Also, we're going to switch our corners here. We're going to take out Emmanuel Forbes as the number two, and we're going to put in Davis. Davis has a better awareness and stuff like that. Even though Forbes is pretty fast, but he doesn't. He stays with the rece the receivers, but he doesn't track them pretty good. He always get caught on. And his and his uh, 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 jamming on the line is really poor. His rating. Quarterbacks like and he gets beat up the line so all the time. Defend, Mike, all right, here we go. Not only can they beat you with their arm and their ability to process and spread the ball out to the other playmakers, but it's their ability to hurt you when things break down. It's just hard to defend. Ah, out of bounds. Out of bounds. And see, you might defend Plan A really well. Man, I'll tell you, you just can't simulate his speed and drive. You can't simulate his ability to make guys miss and extend plays. And when that coverage breaks down, or that defensive front doesn't get home, he can make you feel a blitz in coming. A lot it's of coming. Ways. On second down, it's Daniel. And they'll hold him to a gain of just a couple and sets up third down. One thing you can anticipate with this game, the CPU would be playing a lot of man coverage. Yeah, they're coming in with the blitz. Uh, you, you see, you see the Mike Dale. He's going to protect Eckler, and the other guys are going to come in on the blitz here. Let's see if we can get the ball off. Operating from the gun, it's Daniel. There we go. There we go. Good catch, Crowder. And he'll be taken down all the <clears throat> Good blocking by the O line right there. A nice throw by the rookie from Great pocket LSU. to throw from. Beautiful. He's got his team a first down. And really, the key to this play was just how fast he was able to get through his progressions. His mind was able to process and go from one to two to three so quickly that he was able to get the ball to the right target on time. And I think so often those two things are different. Being open is one thing. Being open and getting the ball on time, that's what leads to success, and that's what we saw here. Here's the first carry for the now superstar from Western State, Austin Eckler. Shout out to SGO Sports Gamers Online, guys. They gave me a shirt years ago. I'm still sporting it, man. I appreciate it, too. Thank you, Sports Gamers Online. SGO. Second and a yard. On the draw, it is Eckler. And he's going to fight forward. 
didn't get a whole lot, but it's going to be enough to move the chains. This offense, they're not interested in taking the deep shot here. Second and short, the way they're running the ball, pound the rock, reset the downs, and just keep the drive alive. They'll show jet sweep and instead run it up the middle. And it'll be brought down right around the 40. Levante David doing his work on defense. Second and seven. They'll throw with that. Nowhere to go. He's going to be taken down. The best thing they did here, Mike, is keep their rush lane integrity. What that means is you have to rush the quarterback as a... You, got, you can't run a screen plays on the center in this game. That X. And when you do, man, he becomes a sitting duck for this pass rush. Third and long. in motion is Brown. That's taken in. It's Austin Eckler. It'll gain some yardage here, but that is not nearly enough for the first down. Now, should I go for the field goal, which is going to be really tough? Recognizing the blitz is just the first step in the process. Oh, we're going to punt for field position. Who you can account for we're going to play field position right here. And who you can't account for. That's where your hot receiver comes in. He points to his receiver, who the defender they're hot off of. That guy comes. Gets you got the, the backward spin on it. There we go. We're going to play the position battle right here. Led out by their quarterback, Baker Mayfield. He was in Cleveland, in Carolina, and then with the Rams. But now year two, and it feels like he's found a home. Greg here with the Buccaneers. In my opinion, Mike, if they expect to leave here today with a win, they're going to have to be You know, Baker Mayfield has always been a good quarterback. You just need to put him in the uh, downfield could open up in a, a lot proper of opportunities for you to take setup, advantage basically. as this game unfolds. He can't operate in the any offense. Huddle, coming up now for first and 10. They'll run with the third year man. It's Rashad White. And he'll good get D, guys. Good D. Couple. Frankie it's Lou, second. baby. Let's go. Receiver in motion, headed left. On second down, Baker. Mm, yes, good play. Good play. Let's go. Well read by the defense. Way to bust that play, baby. The best defenders can just sense when a screen is coming. They can tell the body language of the offensive lineman's pass set. They can tell on the drop of the quarterback. It just doesn't look right. It's exactly the case here. Great job getting to the back and taking him down for a loss. From the gun, it's Mayfield. There we go. There we go, baby. Frankie Louvre again. Let's go. Great work to get in there and make things difficult defensively. There we go, Frankie. Good hit, baby. The offense just couldn't seem to get anything going that drive. They knew they had a long way to go, taking over possession that deep in their own territory. You want to pick up that first down and see if you can capitalize some momentum. Instead, the errant throw brings up fourth Good job, crowd. They're going to have to pump it away. Playing a position battle, baby. Field position battle. Drive. They'll start with a short field, looking for the first points of this contest. And they'll begin first and ten. off here to start the drive but this will end up being a reverse and they bring him down but not until they get inside the 30 yard line a gain of 16 yards good for a commander's first down so that'll do it for a fast moving first quarter of play what will the second quarter have in store we'll have more from Tampa after this I love a well-balanced game, guys. I love it.
Ooh. He's able to get away from one man, but those reinforcements. Good D right there. Good good pursuit. Take him down behind the line. Here's a second and twelve. This is all Madden, guys. All Madden default. No adjusted sliders. Throwing is Daniel. Outlined. Oh, good blocking downfield. Beautiful. Well, that Beautiful. going to be a much more manageable third down, getting some good yardage on that second down run. They may not have moved the chains, but with what they were dealing with there on second down, that's a really nice pickup because now it opens up your play call sheet on third down where it's a little bit more manageable. He'll try and run for the first with Eckler. That's a gain of 18 yards. What a great run down here inside the red zone, Mike. It's so important that you still can run the ball. Great job here by the back. I thought for a minute he was going to score. Beautiful, beautiful. All the way down inside the one. Look at that move. Be beautiful, baby. They let him finish this drive off. <laughs> Uh, look at Jamie Davis. He said, yeah, let's go. From the one yard line, first down. Let's see if we can get an end zone with uh Sinel, our rookie tight end. Here's a run with their tight end. Uh, Spike it, boy. Spike it. He's in. Ben Sinnott, <laughs> touchdown Washington. Let's go. That was a beautiful drive, Taking baby. Beautiful. Business on the ground to get oh, the time you spike it. Let's go. Front. They deserve some praise on that one. Absolutely, Mike. And it really only takes one guy. To Great blocking up front. Great blocking up front. But in this case, give credit to the entire unit. They did their job, and they reward their offense with a touchdown. Extra point by Patterson is good. And the Commanders will take a 7-0 lead. Seven nothing is our score as this kick is sent into the air. Now return coming from the seven. And he'll be brought down just beyond. There's a lot of new animations in the game. The Bucks offense about ready to get going on their second possession. They'll be hoping to match that touchdown from a moment ago. 7-0 our score as this drive begins with a first down. We got a beautiful front right there. Mayfield to throw. Oh, wow. A pass. It's complete. It's Shepard. And he's going to be brought down up past the 45. That's a gain of 19 and a very quick first down. Every once in a while, it just comes down to you need somebody in the huddle to just make a play. And it wasn't a whole lot fancy here. The quarterback just dumps the ball down, a quick underneath completion. And then really, it's the yards after catch that did the rest. And that's what Make it him work, baby. Make always him gonna work. The perfect play. We're not always going to dial up the perfect play against the perfect look. Yeah, let's man up, guys. Let's man up. Plays, and that was a good let's one. Let's man up. Another run here with oh. White. And they'll move this one down inside the 40-yard line. Pick up of 11 yards on that one. It's a first down for Tampa Bay. And a nice pick up there by the back with an explosive run play. And it's important to point out, Mike, this offensive play caller, he's still working off that opening script. It doesn't necessarily have to just be mm -mm, mm -mm. No. using formations, using run game and pass. Unmask the defense and understand where to take the play calling Is that as Boston? the game unfolds. Come on, Boston. Come on, man. Shake it off and get back in the game. Shake it off. That's our free safety right there. Here's second and nine. Come on, Jonathan Allen. Come on, baby. Let's get some pressure. They sent Godwin in motion. Throwing on second down. Mayfield. Ooh. You know, people say that uh, the AI never misses throws. That was one right there, baby. He was trying to fit that one in to Mike. No, we can't bring you back in for us. We can't bring you back in for us. You're going to hurt us, man. Just re recoup, recoup. 
They motion the slot man left. Out of the shotgun, Mayfield. A short one there to Otten. That's his first reception of the ballgame, and it really comes at a good time as they get the conversion on third down. Offensively, landing a lot of body blows on this drive, Mike. Just the ability to steadily march the ball downfield and remain so efficient, both run and pass. As they continue to wear this defense out, they have to find a way to end this drive with points. Anything short of that would be a bit of a letdown. Motion man, set right. Come on, D. Come on, baby. Play big, play big. Let's go. This one is caught by Shepard. <laughs> and he's going to be taken down as we hit the two-minute warning. Way to go, defense. Way to pursuit to the football. They'll come up here on second down and five. I should have played cover six, Willie. Timeout. Timeout. Commanders will signal Time out. for the first of their timeouts. Second down throw for Mason. Oh, yes. Way to be there. Oh, Way to be there. Incomplete. That's one you'd think he'd be able to corral. He can't find the handle, and it's going to lead to a third down. Come on, defense. Play your man. Play your man. Let's go. Let's shake to the inside. Throwing is Baker. That's caught left side. Then they throw it to the outside. And he will Fourth and one. Get to the marker. They're going for it. They're going for it. They're going for it. I think they're going for it. What are you going to do on fourth down? No, they're not. No, they're not. The eyes okay. Of the He's trying to push good this stop, ball defense. initially downfield, but with the defense doing a good job keeping a lid on the coverage, he's forced to check this ball down to the shallow route. This is something that they know in the future. If I need a couple yards, they can come back to this play. And I can tell you firsthand, you, three. you find yourself trailing in a game, you don't feel very good about coming away with field goals, but in this case, it does get them a little bit closer and cut into this deficit. Both teams ready to go once more as the kicks away. They're trying to pin him deep. They'll take this from the three. And he will get back to only about his 20-yard line. That's where the drive will start. The commander's offense ready to take over once more. The lead sits at four. Come on, Dan. Stay command of the offense, baby. Half. This drive begins with first and ten. Come on, give us the right defense we want. Give us the right look. No, that's not it. Now we're gonna try it. Here we go. Are they blitzing? Now Daniels. He's got his tight end. There's Ertz. And good yardage there after the catch. They'll wind up with a gain of seven on first down. So the hope is when you call these underneath drag routes, you're trying to have your tight end come out the back side of the defense in space. So when you put the ball on him early, it leads to big yards after the catch. In this case, they don't get the real big play they were hoping for, but they'll definitely take it. And that one knocked away. It's incomplete. John Dotson was the intended receiver there. Now it's going to be third down. So as halftime looms, Mike, they have to find a way to capitalize on this drive right here and make sure they end the half with some sort of points. Now, that incompletion, not ideal, but at the very least, it stops the clock. Catch your breath, get back in the huddle, and this next play, it's got to be a gotta have it best play call. Third and short, and it's Daniel. Oh, come this on. Is be incomplete. That's great work to get in there and make things difficult defensively, setting up a fourth down. And this passing game continues to come up short these last couple plays. That's two consecutive incompletions in a row. Now they're staring fourth down right in the face. A fair catch. He's going to call it and take it right around his own 30-yard line. The Buccaneers offense going to get it one final time in this first half. They trail by four. A touchdown gives them the lead. Drive begins with first and ten. There's Evans. He's got it. And they'll get about half of what they needed 
It's a pickup of five and sets up second and five. Mayfield. That's his tight end, Otten. I mean, Bobby Wagner overrated. Hold on, guys. I don't want to see how Bobby played this. Got to see how Bobby Wagner played this. It looks like he overran the play. Defense. They're trying to get a field goal. Come on. Here's Mayfield. Got his receiver on the in cut. He's got it. And they get this one across midfield to the 47 yard line. Here's first and 10. Baker to throw. That's to the rookie. Third rounder, Jalen McMillan. First catch for him on the afternoon, and it results in a first down. We're trying to get to the sideline. We got our hard flats up. They have no timeouts. To throw is Mayfield. Yes. Oh, come on. He's forced to just throw that one away. It's incomplete. You can't fault the quarterback on this one, Mike. He really didn't even have much of an opportunity. By the time he hit the top of his drop and got his eyes downfield, the defense was all over him. And he really had no choice but to just get that ball out of his hand and live to play another snap. And that's a really nice boost here before the break. I mean, you work the clock well. You're able to steal some points. The biggest thing is you're able to build a little momentum now going into the locker room at halftime. But showing five seconds remaining in this half as the kicks away. This one will be taken in the end zone. No run back forthcoming. And the ball coming out to the 30 yard line. And they'll let that to run another play. Instead, just take a knee and take this on into the locker room. So, here at halftime, it's the visitors, the commanders, who are out on top as we toss it an hour or so east to Orlando and Jonathan Coachman standing by for the EA Sports Halftime Report. All yours, Coach. Okay, Michael, thanks very much. And with that, we welcome you all into our EA Sports studios. This is the Halftime Report. Coach, thank you. Both teams trying to find the right formula to come out on top in this second half coming up both teams ready to get back at it as we get back underway here on ea sports this is fielded inside the five that'll be brought down past the 25 decent field position to start this drop come on defense we need some big plays offense, looking to get back to work as we begin this third quarter the deficit is one as they'll search now for that go-ahead score. Mayfield to throw on first and ten. Good deep, good deep. Oh! Ooh, that's okay. We got enough to stop him. Good defense. It goes down as a loss of yards. Second and eleven. Now Mayfield and the reception for We didn't get that pick. And he'll be stopped short of the first down. He's able to look it in and get forward for a pickup of about eight. He'll come up to third and three. They'll try to run for it. Here's White. And this will be a Bucks first down. He's up to the 45 yard line. You can see the trust they have in this running back in the offensive line. You're facing a three and out. You're trying to extend this drive. Turn around, hand it to the guy behind you, and let him do the rest. 
Here comes Otten in motion. Mayfield to throw got him. Oh! And that's gonna wind up he got rid of that ball before he wanted to, man. The, the receiver wasn't even looking at the ball. Let's look at that play. He felt the pressure. He had to get rid of it. Look at the receiver. He's not even looking at the ball. See, I like that. He didn't, he, he didn't catch it because he's not looking at the ball. That's an improvement right there. He had to get rid of that ball. Passes, but because they haven't been able to get any big explosive plays, continue to push the ball downfield. It's time for a turnover, guys. Really They're not really running the football unless they have a, a short. On second down. Get him. Get him. Come on. That's out to the flat, and it's complete. Oh. Way to hang on to him, St. Jude. Maybe just a tad short. No, we need to stop, right, so guys. We need to stop. They're running all kind of so plays. If you look at their previous one, plays, traditional handoffs. Yes, Tampa's yeah, running a lot of different back, plays right now. Traditional running back. Number two, you have to be excellent and reliable in pass protection. Oh! Bigger than all of them, you have to be at least serviceable. Out of the great play action. Third and short. It'll be a pickup of ten. Good for a Buccaneers first down. Third down is when we see so many tight ends around the league really make their money. They operate in the middle of the field. They're a big, easy target for the quarterback. And even if they are covered, Mike. Now, I saw something that I don't like. Let me look at this again. It seems like he freezes up right here. Jamin Davis, look. He stops. Why is he stopping? Why is he stopping? I know he's staying with he's staying with the uh, tight end right here. Now, once the ball's in the air, he needs to move. Look. First and ten now from the thirty-six. Baker gonna hand it to White. Nice job finding the seam. Gain of about nine. Just a yard short of that first down. They sent Godwin in motion. From the gun, it's Mayfield. Over the middle, that's Godwin. Gonna be a first down, a pickup of nine. Really nice job here by the quarterback, understanding what did he need to pick up a fresh set of downs. In this case, that underneath drag route was all it took. Get the ball into the hands of your receiver, pick up the first down. Come on, James Davis. Of schedule. That's a first down completion of seven yards. The drag route is such a good way to get the ball early into the hands of your tight end and take some pressure off the quarterback and give him an easy completion. The size and the athleticism. Man, you don't let him do that. More yards, but do it after the catch. Get off your blocks. They're gonna have a first and goal coming up. They try to finish off this drive with six points. A huge advantage to red zone offense is the ability to run the ball. In this case, I thought he was gonna score. Takes it all the way down inside the two. Sets up first and goal. Now Mayfield. Over the top. He's got it. Every time I make adjustments to stop the run, they score. Every time. Tight spaces down there. Things happen quick. Greg, a quick decision and great execution for the score. You're exactly right, Mike. Down here this Or did I run commit by line, accident? Everybody's clock has to speed up. Not only the quarterback processing to get the ball out of his hand, but you have to win as a receiver quickly and give the quarterback somewhere to go with the ball. It was that quickness at the line of scrimmage that led to that touchdown. That's going to be caught. So add a couple more points. And they add two. 11 plays, 74 yards. Mike, I think all of us can remember exactly where we were during a certain Super Bowl. We're throwing the ball this close to the goal line ended up being a disaster but unlike that time they ran this pass play to perfection and the result two points
Good kickoff team is out on the field. And we're back to it as the kick's away. On the return, it's Chris Rodriguez. He'll get this up to the 28-yard line. Nice place for the drive to start. The commander's offense trotting back out for their first involvement of this second half. They trail now 14 to 7. Come on, guys, let's run the offense. Let's run the offense. And 10. Start the drive on the ground, and here comes a reverse. And they'll be set up now. Up past the 40 with that one. Give them 14 on that play. One play, one first down. Try to get our quarterback involved. There just wasn't a lot of space for the quarterback to operate. You could see him kind of waiting for some of the blocks to develop. Never transpired. Didn't get a whole lot going. Short game. Throwing on second down. Daniel. He'll drop this down for Eckler. And nice work there after the catch. He's a little short of the first down. After a game of seven. Well, this is a great example of the old saying, Mike. You never go broke taking a profit. Give credit to this quarterback. I know it's not the big explosive play he was looking for, but getting the ball into the hands of his running back allow him to pick up some extra yardage after the catch. Make sure that corner don't come up. The motion man here is McClure. That's caught by Eckler. And great determination as he gets forward and picks up the first down. First down, Commander. Come on, Echo, you gotta do a good job holding that edge. So, three quarters have come and gone. Back with more after the break. You're tuned in to the NFL on EA Sports. We need Echo to hold that edge right there. And Ertz. You know that corner's going to come up, though. The motion man here is McClure. And no chance to turn and go. That one good for just a couple. You know, really, guys, I'm working on plays right now. See what works and what doesn't. The tight end Ertz in motion. They'll run here. The defense all I didn't want to give it to him. A loss of a couple. The more rule of run blocking for the offensive line is you don't want to allow penetration. It just doesn't give you. I wouldn't have time to throw it anyway. To cut and find the hole. It's exactly how it played out here. They've got to do a better job holding the line of scrimmage and not getting pushed back. He's got his running back downfield, and it's complete. And they'll move this ball way down into the red zone, inside the 20-yard line. I really like the rhythm that this offense has found. I mean, that third down, that wasn't a layup by any means, but they made it look easy. Everybody was exactly where they needed to be. The quarterback did a nice job working through his progression, saying, okay, I understand this is zone defense. I understand where the limitations of the coverage are. I'm going to get to that spot on the field as fast as I can. You know, I'm still learning my, my, um, my different options on offense. They'll keep it on the ground. And he finds some space, tackled after a gain of seven on first down. 
Here's a second and three fourth time. are going to have a first and goal coming up. They try to finish off this drive with six points. Second down at these distances, Mike, you pretty much anticipate a pass, and I think that's what the defense was lined up thinking. In this case, they leave a little too much room on the ground, and the offense is able to pick up a first down. And in motion is Brown. He'll run here with Eckler. And he'll just get up inside those big bodies up front. And he's in. Austin Eckler. Touchdown, Commander. A huge touchdown there. Great the hole by the offensive line. That was a beautiful hole right the there. We got to look at that, man. We got to look at this play. That was beautiful. This was a beautiful block play right here. Did the motion man throw him off right here? Deami Brown comes in motion. Eckler goes out for a pass. And look at this blocking. We go right behind the fullback to no, number 82. Beautiful blocking all the way, all the way around right there, man. Beautiful. Let's go. Your best is needed. Can you come through here late and give your team a chance? They're an extra point away from tying this thing up, and we got ourselves a ball. <laughs> and this is no good. He missed the extra point. Oh. They remain down by one in the fourth quarter. Wow. Wow. Should we onside kick? Nah. to a one-point game now in the fourth quarter as they kick it away. This one taken at the seven. He'll work his way across the 25-yard line. Here's the Tampa Bay offense. They're going to take over once more. Their lead is just a point. They begin it on this drive with first and ten. We're going to strengthen this front line here. Out of the shotgun, Mayfield. Get this complete right side to Otten. And he's going to be taken down at the 37. They'll get 11 there. And that's a quick first down. Not a whole lot complicated about this play, Mike. That was understanding where the holes of the defense were. Remember, in this zone coverage, you got to find green grass, get past the first down marker, be friendly to the quarterback, and then the ball has to be out on time before those zone defenders can react to the receiver. It's exactly how it played out here. You can drop all the fancy plays you want, but when the quarterback and the receiver see it through the Come same on, set of eyes, back, though. it's virtually impossible to stop. And good blocking up front, paving the way for a game of eight on the ground. They come to the line now on second and two. Try to burn some clock here as they keep it on the ground. And that one shut down pretty quickly. He'll get back to the line of scrimmage. Nothing more. Now a timeout here by Washington. That is their second. Talk things over before third down. On third down, it's White. And that call will not get it done. The defense ready, stopping him behind the line of scrimmage. It sets up fourth down. It's fourth down. Kicking time for the Bucks. They'll punch it away. 
as they try to play the field position game here, protecting a fourth quarter lead. And no return forthcoming. It's a touchback and come out to the 20. -yard defense did a good job giving the ball back to the, the offense. offense. Headed back to take over once more. They'll start out first down and 10. Expecting the pass, guys. Getting eight. Setting up second and two. They'll drop to throw. And that would be the dagger. It's intercepted. Picked off by Levante. Tried to force it in there. Tried to force it in there before he reacted. Late in the game. Turnover goes back the other way. A back-breaking score. Yeah, and at this point in the game, Mike, you're just trying to make something happen. You find yourself trailing. Less than two minutes remain. You're just taking some chances. In this case, the chances backfire. I threw it as hard as I could. It didn't matter. Take it all the way back for six. I tried to force it in there. Bad mistake. On is Chase McLaughlin for the extra point. He gets it to go, and the Buccaneers extend the lead to eight. It's 21 to 13. Both teams ready to go. Not over yet, baby. It's not over yet. The kicks away. He fields it at the eight. Oh, he's got room past the 30. Here comes the Washington offense now. We need them to make a mistake on defense, man. Let's see what my suggestion says here. We need them to make a mistake on defense. Seriously. I need to hit something deep. We need we need it we need the defense to mess up here. bring them into the game it's all but over that's exactly the case here it doesn't result necessarily in a sack safety is squeezing to the inside here just enough to can anybody get some start. advantages on second down it's daniel that one pinballs around but it is incomplete I can't exactly put my finger on it, but it just seems like this entire game, like this passing game and this... We gotta get this first down, man. We gotta get this first down. Off, and whether it's missing these big shots downfield like he did there, or just simple underneath layups, there's just something about him today that doesn't look right, and I think it's a big part of the reason they find themselves trailing here in the fourth quarter. 11 yards on the pass there. First down, Washington. There again is Daniels. And a good effort there defensively. It's knocked away and incomplete. <laughs> All right, so this is why you get paid the big bucks. These are the uh, positions as a quarterback you need to deliver for your team. Everybody talks going about straight two the minutes. Not Everybody gonna work. drills it every single week. But when it comes down to this moment in the game, your quarterback needs to be on point. And after that first down incompletion, it just makes things that much harder. Going to throw again. And that's going to be incomplete. Coverage was good that time. The contact jarring the ball loose and forcing third down. Great job there defensively separating the man from the ball. And 
This is the moments in the game where you need your best players to step up. And this guy's showing what he's capable of doing in the game's critical moment. On third down, they'll throw with Daniels. He finds the veteran Ertz. When you're willing to throw the ball short of the sticks on third down, you know what that tells you, Mike? The decision to go for it on fourth down has already been made. If you're able to pick it up with yards after the catch, great. But if not, it's a fourth and short, and you give yourself a realistic shot of converting on this fourth down. He's got the veteran Zach Ertz. 13 yards and a big exhale as they convert on fourth down. Now, this is the epitome of a really short throw and a really nice run after catch. And listen, for a quarterback, it all counts the same. You don't always have to throw the ball downfield to generate explosive plays. And these drag routes can be very, very effective. Even in the air, here's Daniels. One knocked away. It's incomplete. This is one of those situations that plays directly into the hands of the defense because think like they know this offense Let's has try to it again. be one dimension. This has to be a pass. So what do they do? They bring in extra defensive backs. They're reading they it this time. They're reading end. it this time. Let's the see if we can day, go to McLaurin. There's just nowhere for the offense to go with the ball. Maybe we can hit over the middle here to Mc McCaffrey. Throwing again. Daniel. Could be the dagger. It's intercepted. Picked off by Bryce Hall. I think you chalk this one up, Mike, to just a rookie mistake. And anytime you have a young single I should know he swings center, that right out wide. And I should lob games. it up. See, I could have lobbed it over the top. See the coverage. They're gonna get baited into Dumb mistake the right there. That's kind of par for the course. The key is how fast can these rookie quarterbacks turn? Let me show you guys. It's about panicking in the pocket, man, trying to get rid of the football. He was open, too. I, I should have dropped this pass in here, right here. Watch this. Watch this. Look, look at that. Look at that. Look, 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 look. Even, though, even though the safety coming over, guys, I, all I had to do is throw it towards the sideline, away from the safety. Got enough room over there. Got enough room over there. That's all I had to do, guys. That would have been a completion, maybe a touchdown. <sighs> Move on. It's all right. We learn. Make the same we live and learn, happen. right? We live and learn. Operating from their own 23, they'll begin. We had our 10. opportunities. Victory we had our opportunities. As he's down to a knee. You know what? Let's see. Let's see who was open on that play. Uh, can I go watch it now? Um, let's see. Highlights. Where are my highlights at? There we go. Uh, let's see. Uh, that was the interception right there. Let's see who else was open on this play. Nobody was really open, guys. Nobody was really open. See? That was my only shot right here. All I had to do is throw it up towards the sideline. Maybe he could have broke a tackle over a touchdown. <laughs> That's all I had to do, man. That's all I had to do. Alright, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you watched the whole thing. Most most likely you didn't, but that's okay. I'm just putting the content out there. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button if you're still watching. I'm Hollywood Sports. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on my next video. Didn't turn it over at all. They finished on the plus side with takeaways. As a result, they're going to come away with the victory. So that'll just about do it for Greg Olson and our entire team. I'm Mike Tirico. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. For more, log on to easports.com. The Buccaneers get the win. As we say, so long.
from Tampa.